Shazam! And we're back with another product spotlight from your host, Douglas Smythe at phoenixshaving.com. And today we are going to be delving into apparel. What is apparel? What is the root of apparel? Where does apparel come from? Why do we wear apparel? Ain't this kick-ass apparel? Yes. I'll listen more when we get back, folks. But now, intro, yeah. You'll be the life of the party. Well, folks, a lot of you may know this, and even more of you may not know this, but we offer apparel also. Uh, for a long time, we've, we've advertised, if you will, that we're more than just shaving. And clearly, we are more than just shaving. Shaving to us, or traditional wet shaving that is, is a lifestyle. It's a culture we're trying to cultivate, if you will. Nurture. I mean, you're into rock and roll, you have a t-shirt for that. You're into cars, you have a t-shirt for that. There's a t-shirt for everything. As wet shavers, we don't often, for the last, you know, 10 years now, we haven't really been able to express ourselves as you will. So we're always the guy at the party talking about traditional shaving when we could just keep our mouth shut and wear a shirt instead. I'm telling you, this is an easy way to convert people or at least get the conversation going is by wearing a shirt. Not that you need to do that, but it's a lot of fun. Uh, these, I've also seen these showing up more and more at meetups as they, they happen. But these are our shirts and we do a bunch of different things. Um, shirts, baseball style shirts, uh, short sleeves, bathing suits even. <laughs> Bathing suits. Yes, folks, this is my own personal pair of Atomic Age Bay Rum trunks. Yeah. Uh, bathing suits, watches even, sneakers, hats, bandanas. We do it all, folks, because uh, part of you know what we do here at Phoenix Shaving is design. We really like our designs. We love our designs. We're also very into creating a universe of characters around our designs. Yeah. Did you know that? No. Most of our labels tell a story or are a part of an ongoing saga or story or even a trilogy sometimes. We've done shaving trilogies. Some of you know this. If you've been watching our videos, you know this already. But so that said, there's a lot of characters and there's a lot of stuff going on. And what better way to, to get that out there and to express that it, than coming up with our own clothing line? Yeah. Wu-Tang ain't got nothing on me. But, uh, so I thought we'd just look into some of these. Um, first of all, as the baseball shirts I talked about, Raglan shirts, traditional, you know, three and a quarter length short sleeves. These are big 80s style uh, shirts. I had a slew of these back in the day, but super comfortable. That's the one thing about all these shirts is they're, they're like well-worn uh, friends, if you will. No, that makes zero sense at all. They're like a well-worn shirt, you know, something you slip into on the weekends. You have your favorite pair of denims, you have your favorite shirt you like to rock with that. These already feel like they've been worn for a while. Not meaning that they feel used, but they're just super comfortable. They're super soft, they're baby knit, 100% cotton, uh, and they're unisex. They look great on both men and women. Believe me when I say that, because these will disappear. Your teenage daughter, or your wife, or girlfriend, or whoever, significant other, is going to steal this from you. You will catch them wearing it because they're super soft and they're also really cool looking. Uh, both, you know, gentlemen my age, older and younger, are in love with our designs. Now, we cater to collectors as well as fans of our brand. So you will see stuff like Boomtown. Oh, look, another Boomtown. And just a slew of colors. You'll find so many color options here, which you don't typically get with brand shirts. Usually it's one, one color. Um, but we try to do it all. Design is very important to us, if you can't tell. That of her planet, super comfortable, love this shirt. Uh, even the Atomic Rocket. So again, a lot of you may know this, but just haven't gone through our entire apparel collection, because it it's huge. We offer a lot of different apparels. The mugs are really popular as well. But uh, Sangre de Drago, this shirt, people love that. Uh, oh, who's this? Who's this in a boat? Yeah, it's me. Um, but these are just some, some, some of what we have. Organism 46B, yeah. Read that one if you haven't yet. Read the sales page, it's a lot of fun. More Boomtown, another very popular shirt. This one sold off the shelves during the release. So 
You'll be seeing that a lot at meetups. And again, that's what I'm saying. Like a lot of collectors uh, are fans of the brand. Will be this. I mean, you go to a meetup. How many meetups do you go to a year? Probably one. Probably two. You want to mix and mingle with the people that have, you know share a similar interest than you. What better way to show off your interests than rocking a shirt? And it need not be a phoenix uh, design, although they are pretty awesome. Yeah. <laughs> but uh, if you're a collector. We also do these classic dines too, Star. I mean, this is the first safety razor company right here, but only a collector, another collector would know that. Uh, so it's another great way to pull people out of the crowd that are on the same wavelength as you. Like, oh, they, you know, he, he got it, you know? So few do. But really classic brands, classic labels, and even if you're not into traditional white shaving, if you're a fan of classic logos, brands, iconography, also really cool designs. I love this one, just the colors alone. That's water-based ink right there, too. Not many know this, but years, years back, I was a partner in a screen printing business, uh, which is still running. But So I really have an eye for screen printing, or screen printed products. It's important to me. But these are water-based inks, and they're printed in the US. So that's very key. But look at, look at those. Look at that. I mean, it's just a brilliant, brilliant printing. And this has been washed many times, if that tells you anything. This is a well-loved shirt already. Uh, clean cutter, but a lot of these, again, classic designs, lots of color options, and high quality, super comfortable, and very similar to American Apparel. If you know the American Apparel store, at least their brand and what they deliver when it comes to shirts, these shirts are a lot like that. I mean, look at the way this fits. And look at this one. This is our latest design. It's hot. Uh, but yeah, again, lots of classic designs. It need not be a Phoenix shaving. We just do this. This is part of our mission. Not only do we archive or by doing homages to long lost scents, but also long lost brands. We want to, you know, bring them back visually, if anything. And I think the shirts really do a great job with that. And lastly, you won't see this one. This one's a real one. This one blew Matt Prasarsic's mind. He's like, wait, what's that? He's like, the, the gyromatic? That, that was never a razor by Gillette. This was an ad, a French ad, actually. So, yeah, there's a lot of. A lot of great ads out there that we try to bring back and that are, that are mysteries in themselves. But again, great conversation starters, um, great way to show you that you're in, you know, what you're into and appeal or let other collectors that are also, let other vampires know that you're one of them, if you will. Um, and right here are two examples of our meetup shirts. Yeah, we do meetup shirts also. This was for uh, the uh, San Antonio meetup which was great, got to go to that. And this one was for the Big Shave East. And you have all the sponsors on the back. Super comfortable again. Anyone who has one of these knows how comfortable these shirts are. But that said, we do meetup shirts. Yeah, so if you're having a meetup um, and you need a shirt, contact me. I'll gladly put it out there. I mean, we do shirts. So I will put together, you know, hopefully you have the artwork already. You can just send me the artwork, but I'll put that together for you. And I'll give you a couple of t-shirt options and uh, colors. And boom, you have a t-shirt for the meetup. Of course, but we do offer this. And I don't think a lot of people know that. So that is our apparel, folks. Again, I highly recommend you check, you check out our apparel. Uh, some of you got these catalogs way back. Uh, I think last holiday season we passed them out. But this is a, more of a selection in here of what we offer. But we do do apparel. I said do do. Um, check it out today. It's at the top of our menu screen um, on the homepage. It says apparel. And there's a lot to dig through. There really is. But I think you'll find a lot of these designs. Just you know, Some of them are really going to call out to you. They're really fascinating. And they're really, they represent the past and the present when it comes to traditional wet shaving. I'm very proud of them. I really enjoy them. I wear them a lot every single day, in fact. But we do apparel, so now you know. This has been another Product Spotlight with your host, Douglas Smythe from PhoenixShaving.com. If you like, comment, and subscribe, if you don't already, you'll be automatically entered into our weekly giveaway, and you can win a design of your choice when it comes to our t-shirts, short sleeve t-shirts. That's right, folks. Your choice, your size, today. Not today, but when I draw the winner. So thank you for joining us, folks. We'll 
seeing you next time, and Will meaning me, the singular Will, uh, the royal, I don't know where I'm going with that, but I'll see you next time in another Prague Spotlight. Until then, pay it out! Wu-Tang, mother!